Still in the catacombs, guys. Ow. Another large shard. I don't think I can hit it. Too many of them, too many of them. Now, as I was going to do before the second one attacked me, I was going to check how many large shards I had. Another ember. Anything here? So, wait, I'm all the way back here. How about that? There's a skeleton over there. There's something over there. Yeah, there he is. Looks like not that stair, but this one. Oh, that's cool. There's a heat distortion effect. Saw the trap just before it shot me. I don't even exist, buddy. enough to upgrade my weapon to six. The hell is that? Grave Warden's Ashes. Ugh! I tried to finesse it, but not quite. Ouch.
Very interesting, a hidden wall. All right, and here's the place for the catacombs. For the caves, excuse me. Hey guys, in one of my runbacks, I noticed that there was a platform that I didn't think I had landed on yet. It's to the left of that first bridge. So I'm jumping off it. There's an item. Whoa, look out. Look out for that. It's a corkscrewing skeleton. Oh, it's a pyromancy tome. Hey, that's great. Now, let's see if I can find a way to get out of here. Okay, there's a ladder. All right, oh, this looks like back to the beginning. Yeah, here we are, here's the bridge. That was kind of a clusterfuck. I decided I'm gonna put on some armor that does a little bit better against Slash. I put the uh, Abyss Watcher armor on. Is that it? Oh, I thought that was a trap. Wooden bridge. Looks like a very powerful knight. Suspended bridge is wearing thin. See ya.
wearing thin. What is that? Wait. I know you can break suspended ropes in this game. Do they mean I'm supposed to break the bridge? Is that the only way to get over there? Doesn't seem to be any ledges. I like, I guess it's worth a shot. Oh, there's another path. Well, I saw this on the other side in the last episode. Looks like there's a path around, too. Wait. Oh, it's Henri. Oh, hello. We meet again. Have you seen Horace anywhere? I have not. Oh, yes. I see. I've searched high and low, with no luck. Perhaps he's left the catacombs. Oh, Horace. Where have you run off to? Oh, have you abandoned me? No. What a horrible thought. Um, well, there's nothing I can say, dude. I'm sorry. Whoa! Son of a bitch! And a skeleton. So many skeletons. die. Uh, it looks like I can fall on the path from where Honoré was. Um, why don't you take some inspiration from my dogged persistence here, buddy? Let's keep pushing forward. I can descend? Huh. Uh, let's go this way first. Oh, that looks real ominous. Okay. Let's, uh... Let's descend first. Those little spiky rocks here. What's that sound? Oh, it's a fire demon. It 
seems to not like me. Oh, you're a mimic! Maybe I shouldn't have... Maybe I shouldn't have tripped the mimic before I killed the fire demon. Damn. Well, let's see if I still got the drop. <sighs> the bridge is back. <laughs> and over you go, skeletons. <laughs> okay, that was pretty fun. Oh good, the mimic is still over there. Or the drop is still over there. A black blade. That looks like a katana. I'm gonna fall back here and take a look at it. Requires 18 strength. Short katana wielded by the swordsman and distinguished guest of High Lord Wolnir. Shiny black blade is thick, but shorter than the typical katana. Swordsman was a master of a rare technique, traces of which can be observed in this weapon's strong attack. Hold. Assume a holding stance to rapidly execute a lunging slash or a deflecting parry. Oh, this is the Mad Warrior katana from Dark Souls 2. Definitely a fun little thing to play around with, but not really my style. I'll tell you what is my style. Fucking up this fire demon. I don't even know what happened there. Damn. Oh, their own weight brought it down. Wait, the skeleton hates him too? Got a soul of a demon, but... There we go. I think we're... I think we're okay. Nope. There we go. Got the souls for him. Soul of a demon. Demons are born of the chaos flame, but the flame has not survived, and the demons are a dying race. Hmm. Looks like the player character in Dark Souls 2 when we defeated the Ivory King did something about the old chaos. Large shard.
Come on. Come back, you know you want it. Down you go. Oh, this is going to take a little bit. I clean all these skeletons out. I think I'll probably just uh, do a cut here until I'm done. Large soul of a nameless soldier. I'm continuing to descend. Where am I going? Another bonfire. Old Sage's Blindfold and the Witch's Ring. Tire of the pyromancers of the Great Swamp, favored by old sages. Blindfold blocks out unnecessary light, allowing one to observe a, pyromancer, a pyromancy's true essence. The flame reveals all and obscures all. What about the ring? Greatly boosts pyromancies. The Witch of Isolith and her daughters, scorched by the flame of chaos, Taught humans the art of pyromancy and offered them this ring. Greatly boosts pyromancies. Every pyromancer is familiar with the parable that tells of the witches espousing the need to fear the flame and teaching the art of pyromancy to men in hopes that they might learn to control it. Very interesting. If I had proceeded along my pyromancer build path, that would be a very valuable ring. Time to take a break, guys. I'll see you next time.